Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have the Walter guide and I'll be showing you the in ins and outs of Walter. Also, I have a quick message for one of my friends. Dan, I understand why you mean Walter. <laughs> I'll leave it at that. So let's get right into it. Starting with Walter's basic attack, he does a combo with Umbrella. Each hit uh, moves him forward by a little bit and it's also notably kind of slow. It does 10 damage gives 20 ult charge, does decent knockback, and costs 15 energy per swing. One quick note about his basic attack is that you can dash and swing at the same time to kind of change up how you attack. Walter's special is a dash that charges up. The longer you hold the charge, the more damage, knockback, and ultimate charge it gives you. At max charge, this move does 50 damage, gives 40 ultimate charge, a good amount of knockback, and will always cost 75 energy no matter, um, how long you charge it for. Something that makes Walter's special interesting is that you have all your movement options while you're charging it up. So you can still recharge your energy while you're on the ground. You can dash forward, backwards. You can even shield. Um, you have all your options pretty much when you're charging it up. For Walter's unique, he floats in the air using his umbrella. Opening your umbrella um, takes five energy. You can also dash in the air while using it to increase your speed while you're in the air. To demonstrate how good he is at recovering, I'm going to go to the opposite side of the stage using his umbrella, so I'm going to run to increase my speed. I'll go around, and then I can, I can just release, jump a few times, and I'm on the other side. And that only took half my energy bar, let alone if you have full energy, so it knocks you like all the way over here, you can easily just fly back. Walter's ultimate is a big tornado that he sends around himself. It deals 15 damage and a ton of knockback to anyone hit. We'll do ultimate and only hit enemies once. So I'll ult this dummy. He'll take 15 damage, but him standing inside my ult doesn't um, increase the amount of damage it does or anything like that. Once they get hit once by the ultimate, then it won't really do anything to them. So that's something you want to keep in mind. So yeah, let's move on to his pros and cons. For Walter's pros, he has a lot of knockback in his moves. All of his moves have some sort of type of knockback that he can use to just knock people off, edge guard, or do whatever he wants with. He has a lot of kill potential. Walter's recovery is really good because of his unique. He can recover from basically anywhere on the stage just as long as he doesn't get fully sent off and he's able to knockback cancel. His ult has a big range. You can also dash and everything while your ult is active, so you can try to hit as many people as possible with it. Walter also gets his ultimate fast. One good special, or a few good basic attacks, and you can get your ult within literally one hit. It's actually insane how fast he can get his ultimate, and his ultimate's very good too. For Walter's cons, his attacks are very slow and predictable. He has the slowest basic attack in the game, or at least one of the slowest. Walter has to charge up his special, which is very predictable when he's doing it. Ult sometimes bugs out and doesn't really work. It's it's weird. It'll do the damage, but it won't do the knockback, and then people will kind of hit you while your ultimate's active. So it's something that you want to keep in mind and watch out for. Walter's recovery can be edge guarded, so that's something that you want to keep in mind. You want to try to weave back and forth um, to dodge any uh, projectiles or anything like that coming at you. Walter can get his ultimate very fast. Make sure to ult whenever you get the chance to hit as many people as you can with each cast of your special. Make sure to run whenever you use your unique to increase the speed you fly around. You also want to flick your mouse back and forth to try to dodge people trying to edge guard you. When charging your special, try to stay grounded. You can recharge some of the energy it costs while you're on the ground and charging. While charging your special, you can still run, dash, jump, shield, etc. You can use this to your advantage to navigate around people or side dash through people while it's charging, or even block. You can easily manipulate half the hitbox of your special using your dashes and jumps. And yeah, that's the Walter guy. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope it was helpful.